everyone, Peach here, and welcome back to another Minecraft PlayStation 4 Edition Let's Play video. And in this video, we are going to be building a XP farm out of the monster spawners we found in our mining episode. So, let's get started. Okay, so that's what we are going to be doing in this episode. It's going to be, so we are going to be getting a ton of XP from it because right now, all I have is 20 XP levels. I would like to get a lot more so I could enchant stuff. So, I think we're only going to be using the first two or either we're going to be using one of them or the first two because the third one is basically like long gone because i forgot where that the third one is but what we're going to be needing in this video is we are going to be needing cobblestone our buckets two buckets some stone brick well you could use whatever you want really i'm just using stone brick i guess because that's what i had and then you'll be needing bu buckets with water filled in and obviously a monster spawner and this is a very simple design it's very easy to follow it's not like one of those super crazy ones maybe we'll upgrade it in the future but i'm gonna go and get some water from our pond so i got the water um we need to go into the cave that we have it's right basically right behind our um <coughs> our um storage um room so i'm gonna go over here see it's right behind i think it was oh yeah the first one is actually right here we just have to do some block filling in so the first thing we need to do is take our cobblestone and fill in this block these blocks right here because the we do not want these and i might have to get some more cobblestone because i'm almost out well, basically i'm out so we should have uh we're gonna have we're gonna have two left over and we're gonna need some more to go right here so i'm gonna go and mine some more cobblestone just to get some more okay so i got some more cobblestone um i'm gonna fill in this gap right here and then what you want to do is you have this gap right here you want to just fill it in but leave this block right here so you're just gonna fill it all in with by using your cobblestone or whatever material you want to use i gotta go get some more i should have been more prepared with the cobblestone though so i got some more cobblestone i got 33 pieces of cobblestone that should be enough for this one and the um other p other mob farm if you're going to be using it. so then what you want to do is you want to dig um two locks here so then you can when because we're going to be adding a block right here so then you can basically go ahead and hit them because they'll be coming right to this hole the feet for whatever mob spawn we have i think it's a skeleton yep it is a skeleton that's good so then what you want to do is you're going to be taking your stone brick all you want to do is destroy the torch on top and then place one on top just so that they don't spawn on top of the mob spawner just because then they won't be able to come down to this area so then what you want to do is you just want to i'm going to first of all make a infinite water source right here because we are going to need it hopefully i got enough water i might not have okay so we have an infinite water source so then what the heck this something just burnt to death like a chicken or something hopefully it wasn't my chickens but then you want to go ahead and place this water so that it ends up to go right here so we're gonna i gotta figure out how to do it i think we just want to go and place it at this bottom wall oh shoot I don't want to die. See, it worked, but I need to place some torches. Okay, so I think we got some torches good. Um, I did not expect that, but then, as you guys see, and then we want to place it going this way, so that over here, it goes to this block right over here. Okay, so this is just a simple one. Maybe in the future we'll upgrade it where it's automatic, but then you want to place it so the water's going this way, all so it ends up going here. So that's what we are going to want to happen. So 
I want to get over here, but it's so hard to get over here. Okay, so if I go and drop right here, would I end up right here? Yes, I would. So if I was a skeleton, I would end up right here. So we're going to want to go ahead and test this out. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly break all the torches that I placed down and hopefully this works out and the water isn't blocking the spawn. So I wanna quickly break the torches. Break this one. Whoa, okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, I might die. Oh, come on, no. Don't kill me. Where's my cobblestone? So then we wanna go and place it. So then you wanna fill it in. I'm gonna place some more torches though. So then you wanna fill it in so you have this one block gap here so that they're not able to hit you. So hopefully this works. Oh shoot, why is there? Okay, they're coming, they're coming. I sh it should be working, let's see if this works. I just saw a little skeleton. There it is, come on Skelly, come on. Yes, they can't hit me, see? Oh, this is actually working, guys. Yes. We could probably do it to the other one. Maybe in the future we'll like upgrade it so that it's like, you use like lava and stuff, maybe, but we'll just have to see. I gotta eat some bread though because I almost died from trying to build this thing. You just guys gotta be careful. And maybe you should, um, maybe you could like, and have enchanted armor or something. I don't know though, but it's very tricky and you definitely do not want to die because that would be frustrating. And guys, it's actually working. This is amazing. Um, it's This is awesome. We're gonna be getting a ton of XP from this. So come on, skeleton, come on. I wanna just uh, kill the skeleton. Come on. Yeah, we could in the future make it automatic. I just have to look up how to do that because I kind of forgot. I've done one before, just haven't made one in a while. Oh, we got three skeletons. We could get, oh, maybe in the next episode or something, we could either, I'm thinking about either going mining or making a doghouse or starting up a town over in the snow biome. So yeah, and um, basically that's what I want to do. So. Uh, I hear a skeleton, but basically I want to start up either a town in the snow biome, go mining, or what's it called? Get Try to get a dog. So those are my three options for the next episode for what I want to do. I just would have to see, oh my gosh, there's so much dust on my keyboard though right now. It's like just a lot of dust. <gasps> That's an enchanted bow. Come on, you got to drop it. Come on, drop no, it didn't drop the enchanted bow. I literally saw an enchanted bow. Okay, guys, I just gotta get some dust off my mic real fast. So sorry if this is annoying. The dust is just really annoying. It's like, I'm probably gonna be doing like a full on cleaning either to later today or tomorrow just to get, oh, you just hit me, but just to get a cleaning of like taking dust off all my equipment that I'm using. <gasps> Come on, how are you hitting me? This skeleton's like a, a like da daredevil. Okay, I think that is good. We got like 13 bones, 20 arrows. Oh yeah, this is actually really good for when we wanna defeat the ender dragon because we could get a ton of, um. Um, arrows and stuff so I'm gonna go down to the um, to the what's it called the second one and let's see how that goes so I'm just gonna fill this in for now because I can make another one um, at the at the um, next mob farm so I'm gonna first go ahead and make some sticks and then make a sign even though i have signs at my um 
storage room i just you could always you can all i mean it's good to have extra signs because signs i will be needing a lot i'm gonna name this skeleton skeleton oh i didn't even do it skeleton x p farm so we have the skeleton xp farm right here there it is and oh there's a lot but i'm gonna take this crafting table i might do some upgrades to this like add some storage or something i don't know though but i'm gonna go head over to the next one i think it's down here let's see though it probably is down here i don't know though okay here it is so we're gonna be doing the exact same thing Except this one is just a zombie one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my stone brick. Destroy this. Um, bring it up so that they can't spawn on top. Then I'm going to grab my cobblestone here. Um, fill it in. Just so we don't get anything else. Like, so it, Basically so it doesn't. The zombies or anything don't. Ex oh. Hey. What the heck. What are you doing here. I gotta add some more light. Okay, I gotta just fill this in now. Leave the gap so it ends up right here. I probably will have to expand it out a little bit. Because it's like, as you guys can see, there's barely any space. So I gotta expand the room out a little bit more. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. Because there is like no space over here for this one. So I just got to expand it out just so we get a little bit more room. So it doesn't look like it's like in a tight space. Got to expand right over here. Because I know we could. There's a cave over here. But I think we explored it all. Well, I hear spider. Okay, so. Oh, my pickaxe broke. Okay, that's great. Um, I got to place this down. So I'm gonna place this down, make, go ahead and make a stone pick. And I can now destroy this crafting table. Okay, so now uh, infinite water source can go right over here. Oh, it's so much slower than my iron pick. Now I gotta go and make the infinite water source just so we get um, infinite amount of water while doing this. Oh shoot, oh, I placed it wrong. Okay, so I think I want to go here, and it should go here. Yep, there we go, it's infinite water source is ready to go. So now what I want to do is I'm going to, basically I'm going to first place down some torches just so I don't make the mistake of last time. Right here, here, and here. And then I'm going to go ahead and place this water so it goes from, um, so I want it to go here so it goes over and goes to this point right here. Get some more water. Um, I need it to go this side to go over here. Oh, okay. Um, why are you doing this first of all, right? Like, why? Okay, this I'm just making a mess right now. Why is it doing this though, right? Like, I wanna know why it's doing this. Let me see something. Like, I want it to just not do this, first of all. Let me see something, uh, hold on. Let me see something. See if it's like, this is annoying. Oh my gosh, come on, stop. Like I don't want it to be like this cause then it just is like, the, the water is just annoying. Okay. It's cause it's probably a little bit smaller, but that's probably why. I'll have to figure this out cause it's a little bit weird. Gotta get some more water going. Oh, it's so annoying. You can't even like get in the freaking thing. I might have to, okay. Who, you know what? 
I got to go ahead and destroy this because I'm probably going to expand it out by one maybe just so that it doesn't do this because it's very annoying so I gotta destroy this cobblestone I think I might expand this wall right here because I think it's coming from this wall so I'm gonna expand it by one let's see how that goes so I'm gonna place it down let's see how far it goes and let's place it right here Okay, I think it's also coming from this wall, so we gotta expand out this wall also. I'm gonna f take this right here. So I think we're just gonna expand these two walls, just so we don't get that happening, because I think this one's a little bit smaller, so that's why it was going out of it, instead of stopping right where I wanted it to go. So I've got to go and destroy this wall right here and then I have to go destroy that wall so I'll probably um, cut this bit out so I'll be right back. Okay, so guys, I have fixed the problem. It stops right where I want it to go. All I did was I expanded it, so I put the water at the bottom of this, so I wouldn't have to destroy the entire wall. I want to destroy this one, though, right here. Um, probably I will go ahead and destroy this wall, just so I could then add some cobblestone, just to make it match up, I guess, just so it doesn't look weird I guess so so it matches I'm gonna destroy the water for now while I'm destroying these walls though just because water can be very annoying to deal with okay so my pick is probably going to break I probably should fix that or make another one I'm gonna go ahead and build another wall here um not right here I always seem to do that then okay so then i have to just do this one next and then we should be good fill in the water and then we have our zombie one which won't be as useful as a skeleton but it could be good for like dog food i guess if i get a dog like just to feed them if they get hurt or anything so that's what zombies could be useful for i'm gonna place some torches there just so we don't get zombies spawning already Okay, now I just have my shovel to use. Then we can fill it in with our calls. No, I did not mean to do that. Okay, that, I did not mean to even do that, guys. Okay, I'm gonna place some more torches just so we don't get any zombies spawning in. Okay, so I filled in this wall right here. Um, it doesn't matter if this is being able to be shown because it's like no one's gonna see it once we fill it in with water 
So I gotta go get some more water from our infinite water source. And I'm gonna place down some more torches just so we don't get any other mobs spawning in over here. Okay, so this is actually looking really good. I like this. We had to improvise a little bit on this one, but not to buy too much. So you guys, it like finally stops at the point where I want it to go. So I'm very happy about that. How it um, stopped. Okay, so I'm gonna fill it in so that goes right here. Okay, and we gotta get a little bit more water going in this thing. But hopefully it works out though, hopefully. Okay, this is annoying though. This is the most annoying part of it. Uh, filled in right here. We need like one more water bucket. Okay, that's a little bit weird what's going on right here. Okay, I just have to fill it in this one in right here. And then we should be good. <gasps> no! It completely filled it in. That stinks. That completely sucks. Okay, I just... Aw, oh, guys, this stinks. What did I just do? Now I gotta fill it in and then restart on the water. Okay, so guys, I have finally placed on the water without it um, just like turning into a normal infinite water source so i'm gonna now go ahead and play destroy all these torches starting from the back and making my way up hopefully this works out um if not then i'm just gonna be like oh my gosh basically like that okay so it actually works yay it works guys, I'm so happy about that. Okay, we gotta destroy that and we have finished it guys. It is finally done, both our um, mob farms are done. I'm super excited about that. This is amazing, I have finally finished it. But yeah guys, I'm actually gonna destroy these two stone blocks as I don't need them here anymore. So yeah guys, here it is, come um, zombie. Come on. Oh, the water's a little bit like that, but it'll come to me. It just has to walk. Come on, zombie. Okay, so guys, this is our finished um, zombie XP farm. All we have to do now is place down our sign. So I'm gonna name it zombie. Zombie X and then farm okay so there is our sign our officially completed zombie xp farm so now we have two xp farms we have a zombie one and a skeleton one um this one is like a little bit weird because of the water thing all you have to do is hit it and then it'll come forward though but in the future we'll make it like automatic and stuff um i can't Come on. Here, hold on, let me see. What happens if I break this? Oh yeah, it will come forward a little bit. Okay, we're just gonna place that back. But yeah, that's our finished one. We want it to die right here, so then it just brings forward, see, like that. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here and then end it the episode out because it is time, sadly, to end the episode out. Okay, it's becoming day. So this is our skeleton one. And then I might move this torch over a little bit just because it might be in the way of spawning. So there we go. This is our skeleton one. And then we have our zombie one. I might bring a path down here just so we know about it and where to go. But guys, okay, hold on. Before I end up this end this video, there are a ton of mobs. Okay. I'm gonna end it out in the cave. I'm gonna end it out right here. 
Okay, but guys, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please drop this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you're new or have not already subscribed. So, cheers for watching, everyone. Goodbye.